And so I'm back from our weekly grocery haul. And it does not look like very much on the table, but it is more than what it looks like. You'll see in a bit. I went to two food lions. And just like I told that lady, everyone has their moments. I had said in a previous video, this lady said I did good, but she did bad. Everyone has their moments. And mine was at the very next grocery store because at the first food lion, I had gotten this coupon. $4 off if you spend $40 or more. Well, you would think that I would know to look at the date. I can't use this until the 31st of this month. So anyway, I went to the next food lion, spent $48 thinking I was going to use this coupon. I caught myself before I gave it to her. Yeah, I said, oops, I just noticed the date. So I bought more than I would have normally because I had this coupon in mind. But oh well, that's the way it goes. You win some, you lose some. You have to just move on. So, just to preface this a little bit, we are into our last week of grocery shopping, and I will definitely be under my $400 for groceries, and I'm probably like at $340, and I'll probably stay at $350. I'm thinking that I will need to get a few gallons of milk, and that'll be it. So, anyway, this is what I bought. I bought this ham. I have two hams in the freezer, so it wouldn't make sense for me to buy another one. With the exception of this ham was right here, 47 cents a pound. I don't know if it's going to focus. 47 cents a pound for this ham. Shank portion. It'll work well. So when it's 47 cents a pound, you cannot go wrong. Um, so pick this up. This was two forty nine a pound. Not so bad. Not so good. Seventy three percent lean. Um, they had these marked down. The date goes out on June the second, and so um, there were two dollars and ten cents. And I will keep one out too. No, actually, I think I'll freeze all of them. I have some sausage in the refrigerator. And then two things of two cartons of chicken livers. They were 89 cents each. $1.99 for chicken breast. You can get that all day, every day at Walmart, but I did have that coupon in mind, of which I wasn't able to use. So um, uh, some carrots. I think they were three something for a five pound bag. And so I will cut those up and use them in recipes and what we don't snack on and use in recipes, I'll cut up and blanch and put in the freezer. A big can of green beans. I've been wanting some cabbage. Their cabbage was 49 cents a pound. A watermelon, our first watermelon of the season. I'm very excited about this. I need some lemon juice because I like to put it in our tea, my tea. I don't like tea really unless it has lemon in it. So I usually use this because it's cheaper than buying whole lemons. I do have some frozen lemons that James brought from the island when he works there. But um, I don't always remember to um, put it, take them out of the freezer. Two loaves of bread. Uh, the southern dumplings were on closeout. They were like 80 something cents a box. I usually use tortillas and cut them up for dumplings, and they work very well. But these were actually cheaper than tortillas would be, so got those. This was on closeout, orzo, and I plan on using the recipe that's on your collar. Well, just says this is soup, orzo soup with chicken, carrots, and spinach. Some spaghetti because we were out. Beth, or Gloria wants to make some lasagna, Pioneer Woman recipe, and so we will use this gluten-free because it was on closeout. It's cheaper than regular lasagna noodles. My mom and I were talking about red beans and rice yesterday when I took her to the doctor, and so lo and behold, I ran into some red beans at Food Lion. I'm going to make some red beans and rice. Barbecue sauce, I had a coupon, so this was came out to like 59 cents. These were on clearance for 50 cents a bottle. This was like 50 cents after the coupon, 50 to 59 cents. 
These were marked down to 80 cents a box. So two, four, six boxes I bought. I forgot how much these were, but they were pretty inexpensive. So those were on close out too. That was everything. If you look at this, we pretty well have our bases covered. We have our meats, we have our vegetables, we have a fruit, we have something sweet to um, be as a treat. We have our grains. So we did fairly well. I could see making some chicken and dumplings, chicken and orzo, lasagna. Okay, so I can see that right there. Red beans and rice. Um, we have ham. Put some ham and green beans with maybe some mashed potatoes because I have potatoes and I have onion. Some fried chicken livers. I could very well make this into um, a week's worth of suppers with what I already have on hand too to add to it. And um, some breakfasts. And also I have plenty here for breakfast. So anyway. Uh, I do have a bag of dog food on one of the receipts. This was a total of $24.02. Dog food was $7.99. And they tax dog food. So, $0.56. Cents. So, that was right at $64. A little bit under $64 for this. It would have been $60 if I could have used the coupon. Oh, well. So, anyway... That's what this is, so I hope that you have a very good week.